Ah. Uh. Hey, Aaron! Oh, look, an alcoholic ginger. What a surprise! That's not true. I'm only half ginger. Even a drop is too much. Pick! <laughs> well, excuse me. At least my mother's history isn't a family secret. What? Your mom has passed. Hi, cause, uh, wait, you don't know. He doesn't know? Oh, snaps! Knowledge is about to get dropped! Honey, what the hell are you talking about? Aaron, your mother was a massive whore back in the day. No, she wasn't. Look, Aaron, I've seen Titans, and they're scary as shit. But trust me, when I tell you that even the worst of them couldn't match your mom when it comes to the sheer amount of human meat that's been in her mouth. <laughs> Dude, can you imagine the biomass that's been under those sheets? <laughs> I'm no expert, but it'd probably be enough to kickstart an agrarian society. Your mom, back in the day, it wasn't that she was good at sucking dick. It was more like she had it down to an industrialized process. Face it, kid. Your mother's such a whore. Every night she goes to sleep under the AIDS memorial blanket. Random fish death! You know how when your mom and dad first met? Well, he's a doctor. And, you know, he saved the town from a plague. What you probably don't know is your mama was the cause of the plague. He found her and saved her from every STD known to mankind. She got free healthcare, and he got free epilemology lessons. It was a match made in heaven. That's bullshit! Aaron, your parents' marriage was built on the sticky foundation of venereal diseases. Deal with it. Dude, honest, can you imagine what's flowing through Aaron's bloodstream? I bet the kid is, like, literally riddled with syphilis. <laughs> syphilis riddled. Riffleist! I am not syphilis riddled. I'm perfectly fucking healthy. Says the child of a doctor. You know, you only need a tetanus shot every few years, right? Those weekly injections your daddy gives you aren't for stepping on rusty nails, if you know what I'm saying. It's me, Captain Hero. Oh, hey, Aaron. Man, this is awkward. Hey, Clara, weren't you on your knees last time we met? Honey, save my spawnlings! Don't worry, Clara. When's the last time I ever disappointed you? Context. Don't worry, Aaron. I'm gonna save all three of you and then be richly rewarded in bed with your mom. God, I feel like a young man again. Even better, her legs are broken so she can't leave the bed. Not that she'd ever want to, if you know what I'm saying. God, honeys, you might be a name that sounds like a Neanderthal troll trying to drool out the Hanes logo, but deep inside, you are a badass. Help! What about mom? Sorry, kid. Blowjobs aren't that good. You are a, a very virtuous woman. Hannes, I know we went our different ways, but I'm glad for the time we spent together. Thank you for saving my children. What? No! Mom! Come on! You and Hannes? I'm sorry. How could you sleep with a ginger? You bastard! You slept with my mom! Jesus, Aaron, get off! Aaron! Holy shit, did you see that? I just fucking morpheused your ass! Oh my god, I can't hear out of my left ear. I think I'm leaking spinal fluid. No, it's okay. You just pissed yourself. Oh, thank god. Damn, Aaron, you got fucked up! I hate you, honeys! Aaron, look, you need to understand, your mom was a human being who had human needs. And I was just the person who happened to be around to fulfill them. <laughs> but Aaron, you need to accept me. If not for your mom's sake, then at least because I might be your father. Oh, shit, she didn't mention that, did she? What are the odds? What? What are the odds you're my father? It's only 20%. More like 30%. No! God, no! Look, I'm sorry I launched you like a baby getting drop kicked by a gorilla, but we need to go. I am not a ginger. I do not have ginger blood. Hey, did I just hear someone call for a ginger? Honey, what the fuck? You're still alive? God damn it, I was so hoping you would have been claimed by cirrhosis. Hey, now, that's no way to talk to your father. Potential, father. Right, potential, on your graduation day. I've come to see you off. 
Really? Or were you just drunkenly stumbling about and accidentally ran into us? That's no way to talk to your father. Potential! Potential! I love you, Aaron. I hate you. I hate you so much. You make me sick! Wow, he really is as bitch made as you say. Yep! Well, shit, if that's not a gaggle of titans, then I don't know what is. Humanity is doomed. We're all going to die. Hey, now, lighten up a bit. Think of something cheerful. Look at these cannons. You ever think we could just cap off one end, turn it downward, and use it as a steel to make moonshine? No. That's fucking retarded. Well, spank my ass and call me Charlie, because retarded's my middle name. Or, wait, was it my last? You are the worst captain I've ever served under. Ha! If by worst you mean best, because <laughs> cause it's, uh, it's opposite today. How much have you had to drink this morning? You want that measurements in Imperial or metric? Speaking of which, I found out a really interesting trick the other day involving dicks and rulers. How much have you had to drink? Is five metric fuck tons an accepted unit of measurement? Absolutely not. Shit. No one can take this moment away from- That's my boy! God damn it, honey! Well, 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 look what we got here. My own son rubbing elbows with the general. No, not you. Anyone but you. Man, I knew my jeans would do something great someday. This is the happiest moment of my life. Honey, what the fuck? How do you find me? How do you always manage to find me and ruin everything? Hey, now you found me. Here I was, just tinkering with these cannons and getting super wasted. And then suddenly, whoop! Aaron's here! This creature is your father? Yep! No! He's just a sad, miserable ginger that nobody likes! He doesn't look like a ginger. That's because I'm only half ginger. And all evil! Aaron, keep your syphilitic insecurities to yourself, son. This conversation is officially awkward. I require a drink. Oh, well, step right over here, Mr. Bossman. Let me pour you out a scoop of this here cannon. Honey, please stop talking to him. See, I noticed these cannons didn't do much good against the Titans, so I took the liberty of decommissioning them and made the cylinder into something a little bit more useful. Now, I've been perfecting this recipe that'll get you real fucked up. Don't mind the dead bird floating in there. He, he, he ain't gonna harm nobody. Hanes, please stop talking to him. Actually, adds a little bit of flavor in when you think of it. Hanes, shut the fuck up! Nobody likes you! You're not my dad! And nobody wants your shitty booze! Just walk off the edge, jump into a titan's mouth, get cirrhosis, just do us all a huge favor, and die! C come here, Aaron. I want to sniff you.